Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Capture the Flag Vitalism. It is a UGC Steel game um, uh, taking place from earlier this week, and I was told to watch the Red Intel Room... F oh, I didn't know it did that. Huh. Fun. Anyway, I was told to watch the Red Intel Room in the beginning, so that is what I'm going to do, because I always do like I'm told, um, which is complete false. But anyway, um, while we were watching the Red Intel Room and people explode, um, actually some great spam coming in from the Blue Demo Man, um, Blue Soldier gets in here and takes out the Red Engineer. It looks like the spy grabbed this, the intel, but he drops it, um, goes down as Red is getting those respawns. Um, intel returns. Oh, and snappy! That was tricky! The scout just comes in out of nowhere and manages to cap it. I see what they did there. That was very cute. Um, so the rest, while well, the rest of... Uh, Red was dealing with the spawn, or with the um, massive presence of a red or blue out outside their spawn, their scout just came in and snagged it up. So a very, very clever play there by Valve Server Pub Stars in blue. And on red we have uh, the most noble names of all UG Steel teams. We have Honorum A. et Amicitia. And, um, my Latin is very bad, but I think it roughly translates to honor and friendship. So take that baby punching marathon and other terrible, terrible names. Honor and friendship is here. Um, oh! But uh, no honor or friendship in that backstab by Ambush taking down um, VPS's medic. So a nice stab right there. Looks like... Does uh, Mobius know that's a spy or is he trying to... Okay, but anyway, it goes down. And looks like the intel is safe for now, but HEA is having a tough time building up in here, just being constantly pressured. And that, oh, uh, this isn't HEA, this is uh, VPS. And HEA already capped it. Vitalism is so hard to cast, but it's a lot of fun because there's always so, so much action. So we are going to, I'm going to try my best. Please um, bear with me. Alright, so we're going to watch Ice, the heavy for HEA pushing out of um, Red's intel room right now, really wanting to get this medic and heavy combo. It takes down the spy, who is not dead ringing, so actually a good kill right there. And um, the Tracy, the blue medic, did go down, so it looks like Ice and his medic may have a nice advantage here going into last. But they are in this center cabin right here, which is a very key place to defend and um, have control of because of course when you ca when you get the intel you don't run to your back to your base to cap it you have to run to these little elevator shafts which poncho just did poncho the s soldier for hea showing some honor and friendship there and capping that um, blue medic what are you doing oh tracy got caught way out of position i thought he he probably thought that his uh, friends were in the house and they were not so here comes Red's Uber Ice mowing people down. At, meanwhile, his scout just jumps in and takes off. Um, who is. Well, we'll keep an eye on the ice cam, and there we go. Looks like um, I'm a snail lol. <laughs> the scout um, manages to cap that intel. Oh, poor Tracy going down again, but Ice gets exploded. So he was avenged. <clears throat> so now it's 3 to 1. Watch a Floridian theory. So, um, in comparison to the Baron, who is actually doing some a little more creative stuff right here, but, um, <laughs> just love the engineer's noises. But he's being pressured, he's not even going to be able to set up because, uh, Mama Snail Lol is, uh, on his case. Well, actually, looks like he may be able to, but, um, mm, oh, now he's going to get backstep. Yeah, this is no good. Oh, no, he didn't! Wow! This is one lucky engineer right here. Um, the Baron is just... Okay, the, his luck wore out. He ran into um, ice with his minions spin up, spun up, and that was the end of that. So it looks like ice is planning another launch in here. Doesn't have an uber or anything, but there is no um, sentry to speak of because he just took the engineer down. So he, ice, knowing that, is going to be very aggressive right here. Um, Poncho grabs the intel. We will watch him as he... Um, runs away. I'm trying to get his cam. Oh, I'm so bad at this. Who's got the intel? Well, they just capped. Alright. 
We'll try to get to Pacho Camp, because he is an excellent soldier. Um, as we have seen, he's already done it two caps of this intel, but being pressured there by Hyper Zyphirian. Um, the scout rock and the force of nature. Interesting choice for this map. I have no comments or opinions about it. I'm just saying it's an inter interesting choice. A little sentry jump there by Floridian Theory. Probably unnecessary, but it looked cool. We got it on camera. Good job, Floridian Theory. Maybe he's just Floyd and he wants his own theory. Meanwhile, the Baron has decided to go for the more traditional setup and actually manages to take down I'm a Snail Lol. Um, so, good catch there to make sure there was be no scout cap. So, yeah, it's hard as an engineer knowing where to set up because although you have all these great height advantages and little nooks and crannies to set up as an engineer, it, it's very easy to be spammed and there's a lot of ways you can be um, attacked from. So I thought, I played a couple lobbies in this map and it's just absolutely impossible as an engineer. I always just gave up. Um, Red Uber is popped, looks like on the bounce between the demo and the heavy. Ice actually goes down, so it's just the demo right now, putting down a ton of stickies, but actually goes down, so Digix and... Oh, but somebody's managed to grab the intel. Who's got the intel? Um, Looks like it was a scout who was able to get it. I'm a snail little, barely manages to cap it, and goes down to the SMG, so that's 5-1. And um, HEA just looking great right now. They have obviously worked on their friendship and honor on um, practice that on this map if you can um, but yes so it's a first to ten actually so this could be a very quick map or match um, ice goes down to a backstab though so that um, that settles that heavy duel right there not sure what um, the Baron is doing right here he needs to set up a level three and stop moving Oh my god, he's moving again. What is he doing? If he picks this up, I'm going to have a fit. Okay. He's there to set- Ah, oh, he picked it up! Oh my god. No, no, no. You just gotta- you just gotta set it and he's- Oh god, and Tracy goes down to a headshot, so- Oh god, I think he, he dropped a very large charge there. His 19% may have dropped an Uber. I don't see any sparkles, but um, Baron is just being really aggressive. I'm don't know why he's not running the gunslinger if all he wants to do is build level 1 and just continue to push with his team. Um, interesting strategy, just bringing that level 1 up here, but he's got to deal with a level 3 wrangled in the corner and um, some stickies from Big 10, or B10. B, B squared 10, sorry. Um, and that push was just completely disastrous for Valve server pub stars. But HEA looking good in that recovery f or in that defense. Uh, we do have a pause right now. Let me rip it. Oh, nope. We do not. I'm confused. But now we're ice skating a little bit. Anyway. So we are. So, um. Honor Rare. Honor Room and Amicitia. 8. ET. Et. Amicitia? I don't know. I took Spanish and. French, which I know are a lot in base languages, but um, anyway, Tracy goes down to Ice's minigun. He finds the little um, Baron's gun right there and manages to take it down. Meanwhile, I'm a snail lol, gets the intel again. We will follow him, and he's not going to have any trouble doing this, doing some nice back checking to make sure nobody is on him, and he's not even winded, guys. He is not even winded. Um, actually, he's going in for a second cap right now. Um, probably a little too cocky, but you know, that's the scout right there. It actually manages to survive, so I'm a snail lol. There you go. I really like that aim. I'm a snail lol. Oh, and then his picture is a little snail. That is adorable. Oh, that is not so adorable. He <laughs> goes down um, to Mobius's uh, rocket launcher, but actually Mobius went down to that as well. So, I am very confused about what the Baron is doing here. Um, first, we will see what C is doing here, and a nice defense right there from Floridian Theory and his Pybro. Who is the Pybro? Pybro is Noobman1. And it's always so frustrating when you're um, playing Capture the Flag and you're Pyro and you just stay back with the Engineer because the points, you only have four, um, Noobman only has four points right now. Fire Kip, the um, Pyro on the other side, only has four points as well. But like, they could be doing a lot of work that just don't show 
in the scores, which is usually how it goes. All right, so on a room and eight MS, whatever, uh, Fire Cup getting a nice reflect and finishing off uh, B squared 10 right there, but uh, here comes Ice. Oh, takes down Tracy, so that's gonna be big. Manages to turn around and also get Fire Cup in that exchange too. So Ice is, <laughs> Ice is on fire, literally and figuratively. Um, but he needs to run back and get some help before he can finish off this push. Um, wow. C just got right up on him and he um, knew it though. Um, so we're just gonna follow Ice for a bit because he is just a one-man wrecking machine um, if he can. Oh! <laughs> oh, oh, poor Ice. <laughs> okay, sorry. We're not gonna follow him anymore. Mobius! Nice kill. Um, we haven't given snipers any love right now. Uh, and this is can be a very sniper-friendly map. Alright, so finally the Baron has switched to his gunslinger. Um, looks like he wants to be a very aggressive engineer. It's 7-1 right now, though. Um, aggressive engineer is not really what you want to do right now. You need to fall back and um, defend your point. I don't know why he's um, taking this strategy. Maybe it's worked for them in the past, but right now it's definitely not because HEA has their number. Um, so... I don't know. I don't think it's working out so well. They do have their um, pyro... I hear their pyro. Their heavy medic combination just standing here waiting. But that is not as... Um, I don't know. It's not a complete defense without a, a sentry gun. Ice gets taken down, so they will stop that push for a while, but um, Digix, the medic for HEA, has 100% uber, um, but so does Tracy. Let's see if they decide to be uh, aggressive with this uber. They really need to start doing something. There's only eight minutes left in this round if nobody caps in, um, or if HEA does not- Oh! Tracy goes down to a headshot! Oh god. Oh god. That is really unfortunate, and um, HEA seen that uh, advantage just pop down there immediately. Their whole team is on there. They lose the soldier, but no big deal. Demo man rockets, not rockets, but um, Sticky jumps out of there. He's gonna be able to cap this very easily. And there we go, eight to one. So after pub, uh, Valve pub, Valve server pub stars had that uh, really clever, creative first cap, they have not been able to cap again. Um, their defense has just been really lacking. Um, they actually managed to successfully defend right there and it until it goes back. But um, as you can see there's just nothing built up right here and um, although they have the presence I just I just don't understand I don't I, I don't know why there's no level three. Um, I understand that oh never mind Shh. we're gonna watch ambush get this nice. Uh, of course, using the Spicicle, not banned in UGC, because UGC allows everything except the Flog, which I love. Not that I love the Flog, but I love that UGC allows everything. Um, let's see if he can't get another stab. Oh, missing that one, and going down to Pyro Dash. I don't think I have um, said his name yet, so that is the heavy for Blue, Pyro Dash. Fire Kip um, says in the... <laughs> in the chat. At least it's not a shutout. And yes, Fire Kip, that is a good way to think. Um, looks like we have... Where is this gun? Oh, it was over here, which is a really open area to um, put it in and not easily defendable. Blue pops the uber, but not in time. The intel is... Who's got the intel? Intel is capped. Um, looks like B squared Den was able to cap it, so only one more cap needed. Um, for HEA to take this match. Um, going very quickly. Usually these things get a little more stalemate-y, um, but as we've seen, there's just not a great defense. Blue has not been able to... Um, oh god. <laughs> there we go. Uh, has not been able to to withstand these pushes from, from Red. And HEA hasn't even used an Uber every single time. Sometimes it's been a soft push, you know, without the Uber. That... That's fun to look at. That that's a good uh oh, but sapped. Um, Ice thinks that shooting at it will remove the sapper, but uh, I've tried that so many times. It doesn't work, Ice. It doesn't work. 
I know he's just doing it for fun. Or maybe because the spies are around there. But anyway, um, Moby is trying to get in the middle to take back this middle area, does not manage to do it. Right now, Red has been controlling this area for most of the time, and that is really the key to their success, because you control this area, you control the cap zones, which are right underneath it, of course. Um, Jakadi just getting a nice headshot on Fire Kips, but looks like he is in the danger zone right now, because C has a nice... There we go. There we go. I think I was sorry to say it earlier, or tried to say it earlier, but uh, this can be a very sniper friendly map if um, done correctly. Okay, so Baron has his level 3 set up now, and but in this position it's... I don't know. Demo Man gets right here. Easily spammable. Um, and then... Or, or, or he's moving it. Okay. Um, not sure why. It just looks like uh, Baron is just getting very impatient and wanting to be on the front lines, but no, you uncapture the flag. The NG roll is the least glamorous of all. You just have to sit there and wait. Here comes Blue's push though into the spawn. Um, heavy going down, Medic going down, and uh, looks like that is not going to be successful. The red intel is, there we go, respawned. Um, dead bodies everywhere. That was a pretty good push, but they just weren't able to follow through on it. Um, so unfortunate there. Like, might have been able to bring it up to 9-2, but does not look like it. And here comes Floridian Theory. Building a dispenser in an interesting place. Why not? Um, somebody's calling GG. It ain't GG until I say it's GG, Fire Kip. Although I like half of your name. <laughs> um, so Mobius again trying to get um, into this... Oh, the pan. Oh, the pan comes out. Um, oh, there we go. Final cap, I did not see who did that, probably this dead scout. Um, so well done, I'm a snail lol. And that is the final score, 10 to 1. So that was crazy! I thought, thought for sure that uh, VPS, Valve Pub Stars, or uh, Valve Server Pub Stars would have, um, would have a much easier time um, considering their first cap, but uh, they were unable to get back on their feet, so Honorum et Emesitia um, shows they have honor and friendship in pulling out this victory 10-1, to 1. so a nice win guys. Thank you to Ice, also known as Air, my friend, for sending this in. I'm glad I was able to find a cast in one of his games and I hope I wasn't too mean to him. Um, so congrats HEA, HEA and um, good luck in the rest of your season for you and also Valve Server Pub Stars. Thanks for joining me guys and have a good day.